Hi, I'm John Hinchy, a consultant with Logan Consulting, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to deactivate unused system views in Microsoft Dynamics 365 for Sales. Microsoft Dynamics 365 for Sales comes with a lot of out-of-the-box functionality. For example, pre-built dashboards as seen here. It also comes with pre-built reports and pre-built views. In today's video, I'm going to show you how some of these views can go unneeded and cluster your system and ways to deactivate those views. For example, when we navigate to accounts, we can see that there are a good 10 to 15 pre-built out-of-the-box account views here. Some of them are very helpful, like active accounts, customers, and my active accounts, but others may not be necessary at all. For example, if your company does not use orders or campaigns, these views clutter the system. Similarly, Contacts has a lot of out-of-the-box views as well. If we click the Contacts view dropdown, we see Contacts I follow, Contacts influence deals that we won, no campaign activity in the last three months. These are unneeded. While you can limit the things people see by updating security roles, this can become very complicated and very detailed. The easiest way to remove these cluttered views is just to deactivate them from within the customization section. To do this, we go to Sales, Settings, Customizations, and Customize the System. Open up our Entities drop-down and navigate to the entity where you'd like to deactivate some of these views. The good thing about deactivating views is that it simply deactivates it. You can always reactivate it and use it just as before. So there's no harm in deactivating any views. Now, to see what views are public, use the drop-down and go to All Public Views. These are the views that are displayed on your screen. Now you can only deactivate one at a time by you click to highlight the view and click deactivate. Let's do it for accounts I follow and accounts influence deals that we've won. Deactivate and we'll do it for accounts no orders in the last six months. So we've now just deactivated three views. We'll go to publish all customizations. Once published we can navigate back to our Accounts entity. Now when we click our drop-down, you can see that all the accounts views we deactivated are gone, and we have a much cleaner list. Do this for the remaining entities you want to deactivate views from, like Contacts and Opportunities. For all of your software consulting needs, please contact Logan Consulting at loganconsulting.com. Email us at info at loganconsulting.com or call us at 312-345-8800.